Hello everyone, happy to see you here, welcome back to my channel Hi MS Semantics and today we have a really interesting challenge a plus b equal to 1, a square plus b square equal to 2 and we need to find this expression a to the 8th power plus b to the 8th power and a lot of students might be saying hey mister right here is 8 because right here 1, right here 2 and right here 8th power so it implies that right here we have 8 but it's not how it works like that we need to find how can we do this correctly and step by step first of all let's find this expression so what do we have right here let's find this expression so a to the fourth power plus b to the fourth power okay and let's square this expression let's get closer and closer to this eighth power so right now we have this expression which is equal to so everyone knows this formula so this is a to the fourth power we have square right here plus b to the fourth power we have also square and plus two times a to the fourth and times b to the fourth power okay we have something like that right now everyone know this formula this is a plus b square so right now let's raise this form let's a to the let's raise this a to the fourth power in the second power so the, here is our rule if we have x to the power a raised to the power b this is equal to x to the power a times b so right now let's apply this rule right here and let's apply this rule right here let's do this let's apply this rule so what do we have right here a to the fourth power plus b to the fourth power square equal to a to the eighth power a to the eighth because two times four equal to eight plus b to the eighth power and plus two times let's write this as a times b to the fourth power and right now let's look closely what do we have right here we need to find a to the eighth power plus b to the eighth power and we have exactly this expression right here so let's find what do we call this a to the eighth plus b to the eighth so from here a to the eighth power a to the eighth power plus b to the eighth power equal to this parenthesis minus this expression so equal to a to the fourth power plus b to the fourth power squared and minus two times a times b to the fourth power and this is our expression that we really need right now because right here we express this eighth power with this fourth power so right now we, we need to find this eighth the sum of the eighth power and for this expression we need to find a to the fourth plus b to the fourth this is our first step and we need to find a times b and if we find all of this expression right here then we can easily say okay we have our answer so for example let's start with with this a times b let's try to find this a times b at first okay how can we do this first of all let's write this expression so this is our first step right here let's try to find a times b this is our first first step so let's write this expression a plus b we have square this is equal to what this is equal to this is equal to a square a square plus b square and plus 2ab plus 2a plus 2ab this is our expression and right now let's look close the a square plus b square equal to what in the beginning what do we have right here a square plus b square equal to 2 and right now this is equal to 2 really great and a plus b in the beginning right here we have a plus b equal to 1 so this expression equal to this expression equal to 1 and right now what do we have right here we have 1 square so we have 1 square equal to right here we have 2 plus 2a b okay and from here we have 1 minus 2 we have minus 1 which is equal to right here so we have minus 1 equal to 2a b and from here a b equal to minus 1 half okay this is really great because we find the first element that we need to find right here we have a times b so this is our first step we find our a times b right now the second part of this question we need to find a to the fourth plus b to the fourth okay we need to find this sum and then we plug in this sum to this expression and we have we have our answer so let's do this let's find in the second step right here uh, this is our second step let's find let's try to find this a to the fourth plus b to the fourth so how can i do this let's get in closer and closer so right now let's raise a square plus b square let's raise to the second power okay as a result what do we have right here equal to we have a square squared yeah plus 
b square also squared this is our formula and plus 2 times a square times b square this is our this is our formula right now we know that a square plus b square uh, the same is right here a square plus b square equal to 2 so this is equal to 2 this is really great equal to 2 and right here we can write it as a to the fourth b to the fourth and this can be written in parentheses so let's do the all the thing right here so let's do this so instead of a square and b square i write 2 so we have 2 squared equal to a to the fourth plus b to the fourth and plus 2 times a times b all squared right now really great moment because take a look closely a to the fourth plus b to the fourth we need to find to this expression so we need to find this expression we know this one on the left side and right now a times b equal to right here equal to minus one half so we can plug in everything that we know right here and we have we will have our answer so let's do this so right here what do we have two square equal to four so we have four equal to a to the fourth plus b to the fourth let's leave like that so a to the fourth plus b to the fourth and we have right here plus two times a times b equal to minus one half so we have minus one half all squared right now let's let's uh, plug in all of the thing right here so what do we have right here we have four equal to a to the fourth plus b to the fourth and right here what do we have one fourth and right here we have two so as a result we have only one half so plus one half and from here a to the fourth plus b to, uh, plus b to the fourth we need to find this expression okay we need to find this to plug in to this expression right here so a to the fourth plus b to the fourth equal to four minus one half four minus one half which is equal to seven half okay seven seven half so a to the fourth plus b to the fourth equal to equal to seven seven half this is really great so right now let's plug in everything that we know so a b we know a to the fourth plus b to the fourth we find right here so we can plug in these elements into these spots let's rewrite this uh, i wanted to rewrite this final expression right here so uh, a to the eighth plus b to the eighth equal to a to the fourth plus b to the fourth we have square and minus two times a b to the fourth power right now okay what do we we're doing over here a to the fourth plus b to the fourth so i want to separate these these parts because this is our final step a to the fourth plus b to the fourth equal to where do we have this one equal to seven half so right here we have seven right here we have seven half a times b equal to what minus one half minus one half so we know everything about this expression so right now let's let's find let's plug in these elements into these spots so we have a to the eighth power plus b to the eighth power equal to right here we have seven half but squared okay seven half squared minus two minus two times a times b we have minus one half to the power four which is equal to one over 16 okay equal to right here we have what we have 49 over 4 49 over 4 49 over 4 minus 2 times 1 over 16 equal to 1 over 8 so we have 1 over 8 equal to let's let's find um for example common denominator or whatever how can you solve this so right here we have common denominator we have 8 multiplying by 2 we have 98 minus 1 and our answer is 97 over over 8 this is our answer this is our a to the uh, a to the 8th power plus b to the 8 and a lot of students might be saying as i told before a lot of students say okay mr right here if a plus b equal to 1 a plus b equal to 1 a square plus b square equal to 2 then a lot of students might be saying okay a to the 8th power plus b to the 8th power equal to 8 but as you can see this is completely completely different answer so forget about this about this uh, like um, logic right here it's not works like that so on your exam you should know about a mass rules and math properties how can you solve this correctly and step by step so let's write our answer a to the eighth power plus b to the eighth equal to 97 over over eight 
this is our final answer this is my explanation also write your thoughts down into the comment section write your suggestion down into the comment section what do you think is the correct approach correct answer to this challenge because a lot of students solve this challenge with different approach and i hope you understand my approach i hope you learn something new i hope you remember something new but definitely don't feel bad if you got this wrong thank you for your time thank you for your support see you in the next videos also Thank you everyone for your support because this is very important when you when you like when you enjoy these videos I'm, I'm really grateful and i want to say thank you for this it helps me a lot it inspires me a lot to make a new content every day so i want to say thank you for this see you in the next videos and have a great day